Nine inside 50s for two behinds as the result of their foros forward so far as Darcy Cameron floats the handball to Chris. McDonald in front, worked underneath it by Roscoe. And he kicks the first for the Pies. Can they get some confidence back, the Pies? Can they start to click? At the moment, they are just so far off their best. Side bottom, edges it forward. Elliot, here's an opportunity. Thomas puts the head down, charges forward, takes the shot, makes the shots. Can that be a game changer? Oh, he's danger in that kick. Dacos pounced, got bowled and burned in a flash. Another Dacos special. That angle. You're right, he would have That's known in the last finish. minute that he had to convert, but he knew he was going to wear one yep. as soon as he kicked it. He's a classy goal, but a really brave goal to still complete the task. Yeah, agree with that. Turned this over, so Maine's got Cox heading back towards the square, uses Appleby to get to Taylor Adams, who shows his strength through the core. Across to Noble, misfire from him. North will get their chance, like Mason Wood, shut down immediately by Maynard. They're up the ante a bit here, the prize, and Chris strolls in and delivers for Mason Cox. They had the faith earlier in the year. Once he's been out of the team, he's found it hard to get back in, but the injuries have given him the opportunity. Can he take that opportunity? He does here. That's a good start. Collingwood back in front. It's a great pick-up, Jordy, in terms of what Maynard had to do. Played it in front of Elliott. Just held up for a moment. Dacos can take a good kick here. And Phillips set flat hands at the critical moment. Penalty to side bottom. They're into the clear now. And a real opportunity to run in another good hole. And yes, is it, is it a goal? It is. Appleby. Delighted. That's why their ball movement's slow. Their advantage is on the other side, but wow. Full okay. kick. And that's a Freda Collingwood advantage. Taken. He's been in the gym in his time on the sidelines. Dacos a ripping tackle out. Adams to pounce and send it going. That's more like it for the Pies. To stop you from getting back to the next contest. Yep. Now Scott Penelbury has not kicked a goal this year in eight games. Been nine games, nine games in a row he hasn't kicked a goal, didn't kick one of the last game last year. He's never gone more than ten games without a goal. The team needs one right here and right now, and Scott Penelbury is just the man for the occasion. He puts it through. Yeah, that wouldn't have been what Reece Shaw... Goldstein, David Hunek was searching for someone to give it to it. He found an ally. And Williams eventually, then it got a little untidy. Cox to side bottom. He'd love to kick a goal or two before he heads home. Side bottom gives him the first of the last. Gets through to Thomas, and then he runs into Williams. He got a kick out of there somehow. Oh, and Cox is able to play it down to Hoskin Elliott, who almost cleaned up the goal umpire. But that's going to make life very tough for North Melbourne. The Pies have got something together now.